Good morning, York School, and welcome back to another episode of York TV. We would like to start by congratulating our homeroom reps. From 9i, David Marcuse. From 9c, Simon Cotterell. And from 9e, Alex Trainer. From 10a, Noah Marijuco. From 10b, Ruben King, our very own cameraman. From 10c, Kaylin Morgante. Great job, Kaylin. Thanks. Photo day was on Wednesday. Let's hope those photos came out great. Middle and senior school open house was on Thursday. Shout out to everyone who signed up to be an ambassador. Finally, we're sad to announce that Josh and Julius will no longer be sportscasters for your TV. <laughs> More time for us! Get off the set, Elliot! Thanks, Fedora, man. Before we move on, however, let's take a moment to remember them, to remember them and the legacy they've left behind. Even in the passing of the guard, they will always be remembered. And now, here's Ryan and Elliot. Good morning, York School! We are taking over for Josh and Julius. For the week. And so we'll be talking about in-school and out-of-school news. Let's start with the upcoming sports next week. Middle school, middle school sports next week are coming to the end of the season. Monday, the U14 girls basketball D2P... D2 team plays at De La Salle College at, on, at 3.30 p.m. And the U14 boys volleyball, play, boys volleyball plays at Appleby College. I'm dumb type today. Wednesday, October 28th, the U12 boys volleyball team will face St. Andrews College at 2 o'clock in the gym. And the U12 U14 cross country team will meet at Centennial Park. And playoffs start for our U14 boys soccer, our U14 boys volleyball, and our U14 girls basketball D2 teams. Saturday, October 31st, are the championship games for U12 boys volleyball, U14 boys volleyball, U13 boys boys soccer, U14 boys soccer, U12 girls basketball, U14 girls basketball, both the D2 and D3 teams. Hockey season has been great for the Canadiens. They have a perfect record of 7-0 and will be playing tonight against the Buffalo Sabres. On Wednesday, they won against the Blues 3-0. The Toronto Maple Leafs, however, are facing some tough times and lost their first game on the 7th to the great Montreal Canadiens! That was a great game, don't you think? If you're a Habs fan. <sighs> Tis kicks. You know, guys, some people just never change. Well, thanks, guys. And now for some middle school news. Good morning, York School. I'm Ella. And I'm Abby. And we are your middle, middle school hosts. This week was a great one. We had an elders club take their first trip. Whoop whoop, treetop trekking. I heard many great reviews from the excursion. I hope you all had fun. Treetop trekking is the best. We had a few birthdays, so happy birthday to you. The grade seven drama students went to see a play, Hannah's Suitcase. It was such an amazing experience and I thought it was an awesome representation of showing kids a little bit about children our age during the Holocaust. Halloween is coming up, so start thinking of spooky, creative, and funny costumes. I'm so excited. On Wednesday, we had the photo day. I'm sure everyone brushed their teeth and gelled or brushed their hair. We really hope you looked great in your photo. You only get three years of being in the middle school section in the yearbook. I hope everyone enjoyed Elise Fever's visit about her book, The Dining and Social Club for Time Travelers. Ella and I are totally reading it. It sounded great. And it's really cool that Miss Fever was her grade three teacher. Well, I think that... Wait, there's one more announcement. Oh, right, we just wanted to say... Welcome, welcome back, back, Alice. Alice. And we hope you feel a lot better. Well, catch you next time on York TV. Thanks, girls. We would now like to introduce a new segment on York TV.
Many people get the lunch hot meal every day for lunch, but not many actually know what's inside. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's cold in here. Okay, so there are food, grapes, and the lunch sauces. I care what William was eating. How did you like it today? Some days I call it good, but um, today I'm on Thursday, but I just call it okay. And now for some general announcements. This weekend is the International Debate Tournament. Schools from all over the world will be competing at the York School. Our very own debating team will also be competing. More volunteers are needed, so if you need any more information, talk to Ms. Nolan to find out about volunteering opportunities. It's going to be awesome. Finally, the grade 12 film students have just released short films about the mind, to, meant to portray the mind. To check them out, follow the link in the description below. And that concludes this week's episode of York TV. Stay classy, York.